In the same folder as my FLA file, I have a folder called Picks. Inside of that folder are all of the slides. Each one of those has a text document of the same name with some information about the slide. And then I have one called Pick Total. It just has the total number of pictures. In this video, we're going to start loading the slides using the movie clip loader that we learned about already. Change the name of layer 1 to Art. Create a new layer called Actions. Select frame 1 of the Actions layer. Open up the Actions panel. We're going to create two variables here. Type var space current pick with a capital P colon, number with a capital N, space equals space, zero, semicolon. We just created a new variable that's a number. The name of the variable is current pick, and it starts out equal to zero. I'm going to explain this a little bit more as we go on. Press enter a few times and type var, space, my, capital M, capital C, capital L, colon, movie clip loader, space equals space, New Space Movie Clip Loader, capital M and C and L. Open and close parenthesis, semicolon. Now what this line does is it creates a new instance of the Movie Clip Loader class called MyMCL. Press enter a few times. And now we'll make our Movie Clip Loader load the first slide. Type My, capital M, capital C, capital L, dot load clip with capital C open parenthesis, open quote, picks, slash, pick, close quote. Okay, so far, we're navigating into the picks folder, and then we say, just pick, and not the number yet. We're going to use a variable for the number. Type a space, and a plus, another space, current, Pick with a capital P, space plus space, open quote, dot jpg, close quote. Okay, this might start to make sense pretty soon here. So we're navigating to the pick folder, we're saying pick, and then we're closing the quote. Remember the plus sign adds whatever's into it into the string. And so this URL is kind of like a string, and so it's going to take the current pick, which is equal to a number. It's going to be 0 through 5, representing the slides. So it'll load the, in the picks folder, pick 0 through 5, plus dot jpeg. You might be wondering why we're starting the number at 0. When you get into more advanced action script, zero is the first number and not one, like if you're using XML with action script. So just as a good action script practice, we're starting with zero. Now type a comma, and then you're going to type the movie clip that you want to load this movie into, or this JPEG into. You can also type a level right here. I'm going to type MC underscore container. Close parenthesis, semicolon. Test the movie. There we go. So the first one's loaded. Close the actions panel. If you don't feel like looking at this pink box, and just so we don't have to look at it in case the file doesn't load correctly, you can actually double click it, select the fill, change the alpha to zero. There you go. So you can still move it around, right? But you don't have to look at the pink box in case something goes wrong. 